a vaccine would change everything. Totally different picture if we could get an effective vaccine and manufacture it in sufficient quantities to take care of not only Americans, but the whole world. We ought to be putting all of our resources in this area. We ought to be marshalling the best of America's extraordinary scientific genius and our manufacturing prowess to try and figure out how we accomplish that. And we ought to be leading the world, leading all of the other vaccine manufacturers in other countries, as well as the other governments of the world, on a coordinated effort to develop a candidate vaccine and then to very rapidly manufacture it and distribute it should a pandemic breaking out. We're not doing that. We need creativity and we need the astute attention and resources of government at every point in the pipeline from the conception to the distribution of a vaccine. We need to manage this like a war, like a well-run war. We're not. But Tara, we're not. we tried let me finish. that with swine let me, flu. No, we, no didn't. we didn't. Wrong. No. Wrong we example. Didn't. Didn't. And let me come back to that, but, but let me finish the vaccine thing. You know, we, if we did this right, America could not only claim an enormous triumph for science and the human spirit, it would be a major diplomatic victory around the world. We would be consonant with the highest values of American transition, uh, tradition. If we blow it, which we are well on our way to doing, even if we succeed for America, let's say we get enough vaccine for all Americans, and in Fortress America, we're the only ones who survive a terrible pandemic. That will be remembered for generations and will mark us for generations.